good day to our lecture, Madam Elizabeth and my teammate. First, I would like to introduce myself and my teammate. My name is Amy Anak Baba and our lead team leader, Shahno Adaha bin Shah Jahan. The third member is Miro Ashraf bin Brahim. The fourth member is Siti Fazilawat. Binti Sulaiman and last is Casey Lewis and not wasted and we here talk to you about creating customer orientation in post Malaysia Braha program for case study number one first of all I would like to explain to you briefly about our case study which include introduction implementation benefit of implementation and lastly conclusion i will explain the part of introduction of post malaysia and the rest will explain by other team member post malaysia brahat is a postal delivery in malaysia that provide postal and related services for example standard mail shots and postcard courier express and partial Retail services such as driving license renewal, international mail, logistic, and e-commerce for such as e-marketplace. Besides that, Post Malaysia stay abreast with the postal development in the international area within the global counterpart. For example, through its participation in Universal Postal Union, Asian Pacific Postal Union, Commonwealth Conference of the Postal Administration, and Asian Postal Business Meeting. However, last mail issues still offer reported but no statistic published to the public. The vision is to inspire and enable possibility for our for the customer to be able to connect all the people and business of Malaysia at home, at work, both online and offline. Malaysia is will be principal place for business. However, we also connect Malaysia and to all Malaysian with the world outside such as as within. Poster services will always remind the keystone of the business continue to involve alongside to the customer and technology innovating to stay relevant for the future delivering convenient new product and services the mission is to build logistic network that enable our customer growth and success First of all, need to understand customer and do more than just hear them. The business then delivery what they need and what they need it. Besides, enable to treat all the others the way we want to be treated ourselves with decency, dignity and respect. In order to gain trust from the customer, act in everything we do in open and honest manner. Beyond reproach and with utmost sincerity. Lastly, we constantly search for the new better way to satisfy the customer willing to question and not afraid to try. That's all for me. Next will be explained by my other team member. Thank you. Customer orientation is very important in order to achieve customer satisfaction. Hence, Post Malaysia Berhad has taken measure to ensure their service is at top notch, especially in customer service. The customer service needs to meet the customer's need and desire. They assisted the customers accordingly to the customer's need until all the customer's requirements are met. Next, to achieve maximum customer satisfaction, Post Malaysia Berhad provides the customers with a more convenient tracking service. As postal services grow day by day and technologies kicks in, all business nowadays must also catch up with it. Everyone wants a hands-on information. It would be much easier now with the use of technology. Post Messiah Bahar also invests in digital technology and business transformation to serve growing 
e-commerce market. Post Malaysia is investing in its digital transformation journey, including an expansion of its capabilities to serve the growing e-commerce market. The use of social media by this department is also one of their customers' orientation implementation. Many of us know that social media is a broad platform to reach out the people. They keep the social media up to date and spread reliable and useful information on news regarding their services, such as Twitter, Google, Pinterest, Facebook, and many more. Hi, I'm Siti Fazilawati, Bint Sulaiman. Uh, for this presentation, I would like to present about benefit of implementation. First, uh, following the ethical rules at work. Almost everyone understands that there are reasons for ethical guidelines and rules for a good manner. Skill on the job like professional manner will get positive attention. Following the ethical rules at work will help you earn respect and possibly even contribute to promotion and rise. If Post Malaysia Bahad does not care about this, Post Malaysia Bahad will face great competition in the market between other postal service providers such as UPS, DHL, and FedEx. Because of that, staff of Malaysian Post Malaysia Bahad will show to their customer a good manners by speaking to them politically and giving them an opportunity to express their needs and they are more likely to earn their future business. This uh, like uh, uh, example for uh, in future, they will come again for uh, do a, again a, a business with a post like you, cause they are like, uh, they like to uh, reach um, uh, stuff, uh, nice, nice stuff in, in post like you. Okay, for second uh, benefit is referring number. Referring number in 2018, parcel tracking has almost become a required offering for any business that use delivery to get item to customer in just as demanded by individual using courier to send and receive parcel among each others. They are not the mean that knowing where a parcel is at any time can give you extra peace of mind. For example, which parcel post larger express tracking, people can follow along on a point on their item in delivery, unlike in the past. They have to call and check with the time frame for delivery. Sometimes it's a take a long time to waiting to they answer the question. Net ship shipment tracking allow the sender to be a control of their transportation and located freight at any point in its journey. A tracking facility will help both you as, as customer and the career, career feel that little more relaxed knowing where your parcel is at all the time. By tracking your parcel, you can be sure of where your parcel is and what whether it's on track or not. Uh, this uh, for good to both of customer and uh, career team. For the next uh, benefit, I will pass to just to, be, to explain. Thank you. Hi, my name is Kesley Lewis and I'm Winston. For the next benefit of implementation is Post Malaysia Berhad invests in digital technology and business transformation to serve growing e-commerce market. The company aims to be more efficient, cost-effective, and relevant in order to future-proof 
its business by adopting digital solution and automating relevant processes, enabling it to expand its career capabilities. Post Malaysia Berhad plans to invest over 300 million in the next few years to boost its pasar processing capacity. The digitalization and service improvement are the way for Post Malaysia adding that digitalization with increased its efficiency and bring down the cost of service delivery. Post Malaysia has set strategic plans to strengthen its facilities and enable even greater operational efficiency by acquiring improved tools and supporting digital transformation that will result in better service quality for its customer. For example, Post Malaysia has linked a collaboration with Shopee Malaysia by providing free shipping for all 12 million of the e-commerce platform users. Truly, embarking on a digital transformation is an instrumental step in securing and seizing new market opportunities. For the last benefit of implementation is, Post Mesa engages its customer mainly through social media. With social media, it can introduce the best app for local courier and parcel delivery to the audience. Many social media users today has smartphone and can access their account on the move with the google app store as well as other app store service provider it can create an app using social media to get international record recognition and 24 hour access in addition to search engine optimization and pay-per-click advertising social media marketing has proven to be an effective way to promote and sell the product and services. Expand the market reach. One of the advantages of social media they can reach are wider audience. Using different channels like Facebook, Twitter, or Instagram make it easier for marketers to build more connection and establish brand's presence. Increased visibility social media offer lots opportunities for people to discover the delivery company, including through the organic posts, ads, and interaction with other users. By sharing the content and the link of website on social media, it provides users the opportunity to visit the website and learn more about brand, product, and services. In conclusion, the implementation of creating customer satisfaction in Post Malaysia Bahad consists of customer orientation is very important in order to achieve customer satisfaction. To achieve maximum customer satisfaction, Post Malaysia Bahad provides their customers with consultant service, improving tracking parcel system and also using brochures and poster to reach out to their customers and the usage of social media to provide as much information needed by their customer. Other than that is the benefit of implementation in creating customer satisfaction consists of a good customer orientation will ensure customer to always be able to give feedback, increase customer satisfaction and royalty. This implementation and benefits will help the customer to achieve their needs and want from the service provided. That's all for our group. Thank you, madam.